Hello everyone and welcome again to Wearholic. Today I will show you how I made my first Wear OS watch face and guide you through the step by step process of creating your own custom watch face. So let's get started with the video. First you need to download watch face studio on your PC or laptop. You can search for watch face studio on Google or use the link I've added in the description. After downloading, install it. It's already installed on my laptop so I'm going to open it. This is the main interface of Watchface Studio. I'll create a new project and name it Wearholic Watchface. I selected the default size. Here, I can make a custom Wear OS Watchface by dragging and dropping components. To add a component, click here. I have different components here like text, images, shapes, progress bars, animations, time and complication slot. First, I'm going to add the time, day and date. I'll add a digital clock in the middle and the date and day below it. Now this watch face has a basic components that fulfill the essential needs of a watch. Next I'm going to add an animation at the bottom. So I choose the animation component and select this bare GIF. I'll adjust it according to the watch screen. Now at the top I'll add my YouTube channel name, Wearholic. After this I'll add some complications below it. Now it's done. I have created this watch face according to my preferences. I'm finished but you can edit according to your own preference and you can also use the always on display and gyro features. Now it's time to test it. I have a Galaxy Watch 5 but you can use any other watch that runs on Wear OS. First you need to enable developer mode on your watch. Next open settings on your watch and go to about watch. Open software information and tap on software version 5 times to enable developer mode. Now go to the developer options and turn on the ADB debugging toggle. Scroll down and tap on wireless debugging. Turn on the toggle and tap on allow. Now you will see the IP address and port number of your Samsung watch. Next, go to the wireless debugging section of your Galaxy watch and tap on pair new device. Now go to the watch face studio and tap here on run on device. Tap on the plus icon. Now enter the pairing code and other details from your watch and tap on OK. Wait for some time to connect. If connected, your watch will show the watch face you created. If it doesn't, then try another way to connect it. Open the command prompt on your PC. To connect watch face studio with the Galaxy watch, you will need to install the ADB tool. For this, visit the URL provided in the description to download the ADB tool. Once downloaded, extract the zip file to a folder of your choice. Open the extracted folder and copy the folder's path. Now go to the directory where ADB is installed. In command prompt, type cd followed by the path you just copied and press enter. This will navigate you to the directory where the ADB tool is located, allowing you to proceed with connecting your laptop to the watch. For me, the path is this. So type cd and paste the path. This will open the correct directory. Now type adb pair ip address colon port. Take the ip address and port from your watch and press enter. Now you need to give one more command. This time type adb connect ip address colon port and press enter. Your watch and laptop will be connected. Now go back to the watch face studio and click on run on device and you'll see the created watch face on your watch screen. That's it. That's the complete process of creating your own custom watch face with complications. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and comment if you have any queries and don't forget to subscribe to Wearholic for more videos like this. See you in the next video. Until then, bye bye.